cross-platform marketing. We talk a lot about this today and we see the statistic, though you and I, we know that tablets are stagnating, even maybe declining, uh, laptops, nah, let's see how it goes. Normally, people, more than 70% people, as we saw today, and as you know, having four devices, sometimes more. Like, what's your strategy for this? How do you, how do you treat this? Are you adapting from one to one, or are you like, yeah, free? I think that is a, a really challenging uh, thing to do, and I always say that's probably the, the holy grail of, of advertising, to be able to do that um, really, really accurately. And there are many providers out there, for example, All In One Media, who do that on, on their platform, that allow us to build that full customer um, picture but it is uh, really not, um, not that simple. So there are different technologies we have to use. I always say the CMO nowadays has to be a um, marketeer, has to be a uh, computing uh, specialist, a computer scientist and a data scientist. And it's getting more and more complex. So looking at you know, cross-device uh, platforms such as AdBrain, Drawbridge, TabAd and others, and uh, you never get 100% the, the true story, but you have to make certain assumptions around that. And from a marketing or planning perspective for us, it's really important to you know, uh, use common sense as well. We have uh, different technologies that help us amplify. Um, and I think the biggest challenge actually is communication. So we need to make sure that we have, you know, the TV buying schedule, that we speak to the creative uh, agency to make sure that they uh, provide us with uh, suitable creative for the different platforms. So I think communication is actually a really, really big challenge, getting everyone on the same page and executing on the same strategy, pretty much. To do that video for us is a really well performing um, format absolutely fantastic we saw what um, Tatiana showed earlier that we had 129 percent growth uh, year on year in the UK on mobile video and that is uh, especially driven by social but also kind of other other platforms as well the important tip I would say is that you have to personalize it as much as you can you have to keep it as short as you possibly can and ideally use uh, subtitles because 80% of video that is watched on Facebook is actually watched without the sound being uh, switched on. We talk about trends uh, around mixed reality, so you have a real reality and uh, something that augments that reality, virtual reality. There's so many different trends, but I think the most important thing is to know that it's happening faster and faster and that you are able to react. Prime example of that, within I think a week's time, Pokemon Go overtook the user number of Twitter on Android within really a matter of days. So this is how quickly things can change.